So I've been consistently working out three days a week for about four years now. And over the past four years, I see a lot of great benefits. So today I would like to share my five benefits on what you can see when you start working out consistently. Coming up. Hey, what's up guys? This is Max. I'm just an average working dude who is on my journey to find my max in physique transformation through a sustainable fitness lifestyle. I welcome you to join me on my journey and hopefully I can help you to find your max. And today's videos are sponsored by Find Your Max Workout Journal and we will talk more about that later. So I'm coming up to about four years in my fitness journey. I started when I was age 30. Since age 30, I've been trying to consistently go into the gym, uh, minimum about three times a week. There are a lot of great benefits in working out. We all know that. And, uh, but I do see there are top five benefits that I see. And that today I would like to share those benefits to you. And hopefully you can really set your mind and start working out consistently. The first benefit I see that really helped me out is definitely your physiques, right? So for me, predominantly my workouts are all weight training. So I deal with a lot of barbells, dumbbells, you know, it's all weights. But regardless of what kind of training that you do, it doesn't matter if it's weight training, if you're doing yoga, if you're doing running, if you're doing, if you're doing marathons, what not okay at least having some sort of this active lifestyle it will definitely change your body right so for me i was more a bigger person you know i have a lot of fat stored around my abdominal areas by simply working out it make my shoulder broader it make my chest bigger it make my back uh fuller right and overall and those are kind of the physiques that i like right i like that kind of you know the physique like the rock that's kind of where i want to go and so that's why my training is more geared towards weight training but it doesn't matter if you are doing weight trainings or if you're doing uh you know marathons or if you're doing runnings and whatnot all those things will definitely change your body to what you like um obviously depending on how you want to look they have different styles of training right so but you probably want to gear towards it but if you work out consistently it doesn't matter what it is if you stick to either weight training for period, long periods of time or if you do running for long periods of time your body will eventually get into uh, it will definitely adapt and make you more suitable for that particular looks that you're looking for regardless the top one benefits of consistent workout is definitely you'll see your physique changing to where you're geared towards to right to depending on your workouts all right so the benefit too of consistent workout is it trains your mind the benefit i see when i'm having a consistent workout is definitely i feel like i am less stressed out there are studies shows that having a consistent workout habit it can reduce your stress level significantly so nowadays everybody are stressed out there are lots of things happening we are still in a pandemic world we are still trying to navigate this whole new lifestyle that we're getting into uh, for myself i have business on the go and uh, i have obligations on the go and and sometimes it can get really stressful and it doesn't matter what it is and for me one of the way for me to de-stress is not just sitting down and watch netflix or watch youtube even though i still do that however i choose to go to the gym right and i would get a good sweat on i would push some iron i would do some squats and after the workout i feel much better because during the workout, your body would actually produce a hormone called endorphin and actually makes you happier. It's your happy hormones. So I think consistent workout, it actually makes me a lot happier. It actually makes me more stress resilient. I'm able to take on more because I work out consistently and I'm able to de-stress a lot of the, I can put a lot of things into the gym and letting it go. So the second thing I see that helped me a lot is helping out with my mental health. The third benefit that I see is when you are working out consistently, it's definitely you are investing in your own health. And by doing this consistently and constantly, you know, you're just putting money in the bank, but not in the actual bank, but you are putting it into your health. And why do I say this is so important? A lot of the personal finance gurus out there, they were definitely having one constant suggestion, which is have an emergency fund. Now, the same principle applies into our own health. I feel like having this consistent workout habit, it is like creating your own emergency fund. It just doesn't have a, and you cannot see the number, right? You don't see the number grows, but it is there when you need it. So one of the prime example for you is that early this month, I got into a car accident. I got hit, my car is totaled, airbag was deployed. I got whiplashes, my neck and my back are in pain. So when I was starting my rehab process, so I asked my physiotherapist that, hey, you know what? Like, what are the effects for people 
um, who work out and who don't work out and having the same style of injuries. And the physiotherapist told me straight up that if you already have a constant workout habit and um, if you are able to keep it up, obviously your body is in a better state than people who actually who just sit on their couch all day, who is a couch potato, you know, compared to people who don't work out at all. For people who work out tends to have more muscle mass, the bones are actually more dense. If you work out constantly, you are investing in yourself, in your health, little by little, and you don't even see it. But when you need it, if you get sick, right, if you get in a car accident like myself, your body can heal a lot more faster because your health level is just much higher than compared to people who don't work out at all. Now, I'm not saying that, oh, okay, you will definitely like, you know, you're not gonna get hurt if you, you just work out. No, that's not what I'm saying, but what I'm saying is, study have shown that if you work out consistently, but your body would definitely have better immune system, you know, but doesn't mean that you're not gonna catch cold, right? For myself, I haven't been sick for a while, for at least, you know, three or four years, ever since I started working out consistently, right? So it doesn't mean that, okay, oh, if you work out, nothing gonna happen to you. You actually, you know, you still gotta take a consideration of balanced nutrition, right? You gotta drink your water intake. You still gotta take your multivitamins, right? The basics, right? So I think at the end of the day, you know, having a consistent workout habit it is one of the base level things and i think overall you just want to aim for that healthy lifestyle all right before we go to benefit four and five let's hear from our sponsor for the day find your max workout journal find your max journal can track 96 days worth of exercise with a special table of content system which can help you go back to your old exercise records with ease and clarity we have sections for you to track your progress periodically so you can stay motivated Find Your Max Journal is only on Amazon. The links are in the description down below. Now back to the topic. All right, the fourth benefit that I see ever since I start workout consistently is the fact that, hey, I get to eat more junk food and I don't have to worry about getting fat per se. You know, if you have a consistent workout habit, you know that your activity level are higher than normal people. And you know what? A lot of people who don't have a consistent workout habit, they're always calorie pinching. I don't think that it's a healthy way of lifestyle because I do think that, you know, yes, we should be kind of watch what we eat and definitely choose a better choice of food. However, you know, a lot of people who just focus on cutting the calories and trying to look better. But I do think that having a consistent workout lifestyle, you know, it definitely, if once you build up your muscle mass, you know, even if you walk more, if you walk 10,000 steps a day, at the end of the day, you can still eat a bit more. A lot of my training, it's weight training, and weight training, it helps with building muscles. And I do think that one of the greatest benefits I see is that I'm now able to enjoy a cheat meal. And I don't feel guilty about it because I know that, hey, you know what, I'm gonna work it off in the next day or the next, or my next training day. Or even that, even if I don't work out the next day, it doesn't matter because I have already increased my muscle mass, then I'm able to burn off that calorie much faster. And again, right, if I wanna go bodybuilding competitions or whatnot, if I'm gonna compete, then that is not the lifestyle I'm talking about because in my channel, I wanna talk about sustainable fitness lifestyle. I wanna talk about how you're able to enjoy life and still having a healthier lifestyle. So if you are consistently working out, then you'll be able to enjoy more good food and without feeling guilty per se. The fifth and final benefit I see from workout consistently is that I'm more disciplined and I get to train delaying my gratification. So why this is so important? Because we know that, you know, workout, it doesn't mean that if you work out today, if you bust your ass off for today and your body, you're gonna get your six pack tomorrow. We all know that's not how it works. And guess what? Ironically, everything in life kind of works the same. If you want to be a wealthy person, guess what? You got to work for it. You probably want to build a business. You probably, if you're into sales, well, guess what? You need to build your clientele. And I think everything in life, it doesn't, success don't happen overnight. And by actually practicing working out consistently, you actually see that, right? Because we're looking, we're trying to stretch it this long term. We're not just looking at like, oh, what's going to happen tomorrow? We're not going to look at what's going to happen next week. We're actually looking at down like, okay, a couple, like, you know, three months down the road, six months down the road, a year down the road, two years down the road, 10 years down the road, right? So we are stretching the timeline much longer. We are just doing the same thing over and over again. You, right? One of the things that you see is like train, you eat, you sleep right? And you go over and over, over again. And I feel like by actually work out consistently, I'm able to practice discipline and also delay my gratification. I can now be like, hey, you know what? I can eat, you know, uh, a piece of donuts or I can eat 
you know, a chicken breast, right? So I'm like, okay, you know what? If I want to see result, I will need to train myself to eat that chicken breast. And that's the thing in life too, right? Sometimes you need to do those boring things in order to see results. And I feel like this is such a, such a simple concept that a lot of people are, are forgetting about that, right? A lot of people forget about that, that sometimes you just need to go through the grind and you just need to do the same thing over and over and over again for you to see that result. For me, I can translate going to the gym into my real life experience as well, right? So again, this is the benefits that I really see that I'm learning in my life that I can apply in my real life experience. Okay, so today's five benefits is something that I actually go through for the past three years. Those are the things that I see and that really help me out. And hopefully I wanna share that to you and hopefully you can get started today. You know, having a sustainable fitness lifestyle doesn't mean that you need to train like The Rock. You don't need to train like the bodybuilder. It just takes time. You just need to take, you know, it takes step by steps and it doesn't happen overnight. It, it takes some time and eventually once your habit becomes autopilot, everything will become easier. And that's why I really, really stress out people that, you know what, you don't, in the beginning, you just gotta do it. You just need to really incorporate that in your life. And those are really, really important. Even if you are consistently walking 10,000 steps a day, you know, having that active lifestyle, it can really, it is a start. You don't need to work out like um, any sort of athletes because we're not athletes. We're day to day, we're average Joe, we have work, we have obligations, right? So at the end of the day, it's just having that mentality in and just do the best you can. Let me know in the comment section down below, what is your favorite benefits of working out? Let me know. I would like to chat. If you're looking to create a sustainable fitness lifestyle, I suggest to get yourself Find Your Max workout journal because if you fail to plan, you plan to fail. And number two is I have created a playlist of videos uh, talk about how to create a sustainable fitness lifestyle and you should be able to see it right about now. All right guys, until next time, peace.